Now here's a worksheet for calculating how much money you need to run the business on an ongoing basis after you've launched. And you see many of the items here, they're the same. I'll only get rid of a couple of them. Business registration, you see, you don't actually need because you're already past that. But everything else, you need to keep. Not every business will have every one of these elements, but you just note which ones you have. Domain name, you know you got to renew that every year. It's still $10, right, per month. So it's like, let's say, $1 a month. And so you need to do this on maybe website. Instead of development, you need to do maintenance, and maybe maintenance will be like $100 a month or $50 a month, but it is monthly. And so you would fill this out, usually on an ongoing basis. Employees and rent take most of the money. If you have a business that doesn't have employees or rent, it may be product development or inventory that is going to require most of the money. Most businesses have at least one of those. It's really rare that businesses don't have any of those. If you don't have any of those, you're lucky because you have avoided some of the biggest expenses. Now, when you create this list and you, you add it up, then how many months is it going to take you to break even financially? So there's another item here that wasn't in the other worksheet. How many months will it take to get to break even and eventual profitability? So you may underestimate. So just add double. So like, let's say you think it's three months to get to break even, give yourself six months. And that way, when you add this up, so you, whatever number you come up with, when you created all this, you just multiply that number by the months that you estimate that you will take you to get to break even, and that's how much money you need to raise. So if you are just starting your business, then it's the previous worksheet for just launching, plus this worksheet for running your business until it's break even. You need to add up the two worksheets. And if you're just running, the, if you're already running this business, then you really just need to do this one worksheet and see that's how much money. So you, you eventually, after doing these worksheets, you'll come up with how much money you will need to raise. And so in the next worksheet, we will look at fundraising strategies for exactly how to get that money. Did you find this insightful? Was it useful in your journey to improve your productivity and increase your bottom line? If so, we have some good news for you. Along with other outstanding lecturers, we have developed a wealth of resources, including tools and online courses, many of them which are free, by the way, in order to help you develop your understanding of your business, bring clarity to your journey, and see what works for your enterprise. Get in touch today.